It's possible and actually surprisingly easy to create wholly new transitions for SwiftUI, allowing us to add and remove views using entirely custom animations. This functionality is made possible by the modifier transition, which accepts any view modifier we want. The catch is that we need to be able to instantiate the modifier, which means it needs to be one we create ourselves. To try this out, we could write a view modifier that lets us mimic the pivot animation in Keynote. It causes a new slide to rotate in from its top left corner. In Swift UI speak, that means creating a view modifier that causes our view to rotate in from one corner without escaping the bounds it's supposed to be in. Swift UI actually gives us modifiers to do just that. Rotation effect lets us rotate a view in 2D space. And clipped stops a view from being drawn outside of its rectangular space. Rotation effect is similar to rotation 3D effect, except it always rotates around the z-axis. However, it also gives us the ability to control the anchor point of the rotation, which part of the view should be fixed in place as a center of the rotation. SwiftUI gives us a unit point type for controlling the anchor, which lets us specify an exact XY point for the rotation, or use one of the many built-in options, dot top leading, dot bottom trailing, dot center, and so on. Let's put all this into code by creating a corner rotate modifier struct that has an anchor point to control where the rotation should take place and an amount to control how much rotation should be applied. We'll say struct corner rotate modifier conforms to view modifier. Let amount double. Let anchor point unit point. Funk body content content returns some view. Content dot rotation effect dot degrees amount. Anchor the anchor dot clipped. The addition of dot clipped there means that when the view rotates, the parts that are lying outside its natural rectangle don't get drawn. We can try that straight away using the modifier transition, but it's a little bit unwieldy. A better idea is to wrap that in an extension to any transition, making it rotate from minus 90 to zero on its top leading corner. Extension, any transition. Static var pivot, any transition. Dot modifier, active corner rotate modifier, amount minus 90, anchor dot top leading. Identity, corner rotate modifier, amount zero, anchor dot top leading. With that in place, we can now attach a pivot animation to any view using this. Dot transition, dot pivot.